If you watch my channel, you probably saw a short form video I did on this, my beloved Craftsman mower with a Honda engine. It blew up on me the other day and I kind of had to decide what I was going to do. I've been wanting a new mower for a while now and I really like the Honda engine on it. I don't know if I want to go to electric just yet. Everyone's saying the Ego, yeah, Ego looks promising. Maybe Ryobi, maybe Toro, maybe Milwaukee. They're all very pricey. So I look back at the gas powered mowers. Honda HRN, $550. HRX is $700. And if you didn't know, Honda's about to be discontinued. Actually, they already did stop manufacturing Honda motors last year in 2023. I also didn't really want to buy another used mower. Currently behind the camera is the last used mower that I bought and it lasted a week. That's my bad for not inspecting it much better than I did. So I decided I don't think I am ready to let go of this mower just yet. So took a good old trip to the Hobo Freight and got this, the Honda Clone 6.6 pounds of torque at 2500 rpms Looks like it comes with some hardware and a tool. Let's see, let's see. Engine components. Engine components. I feel like we're missing stuff. I feel like that should not be it. Interesting. I thought it was gonna come with all the necessary cables. Guess we gotta reuse that stuff. Man, this thing really polished up. It looks like a brand new Honda. After realizing I had to get a pulley adapter, I would have had to get new blades would have had to get more cables because it didn't come with any cables. That Predator engine after taxes was already $300. So after all that, it just started stacking up and up. I paid $495 for this Honda. We have a much better package deal here. I said I didn't want to buy a new mower. I also said I didn't want to buy a used mower. Could have bought a used Honda for much cheaper than this, but I guess I decided to bite the bullet, get a new one. I've had this thing for about a week now and it is a very solid mower. Feels very quality super solid build starts up very easily first pull every time so far and it's just been a great mower so far 